but if I could just say one word that it does make you feel, I would say juicy. <laughs> the channel my name is Shantae for those who are new in today's video we're gonna be talking about all of the supplements that I take to just keep my skin looking right my hair growing you know just and just my overall health so if you guys want to know the supplements that I take in my regimen and if you should add any of these to yours do not forget to like comment and subscribe and let's get right into the video and just a small disclaimer I know this is kind of self-explanatory but I did want to mention that all of the supplements that I will be showing in today's video, A, I have done my research on, and B, I have consulted medical professionals before adding them into my regimen. So I highly, highly recommend that you guys do the same because what might work for me might not work for you, okay? All right, we good? All right, now nah, let's for real get into the video. All right, y'all, so the first thing I'm going to be talking about is a burdock root. Burdock it says it on the actual thing but one of the benefits is for joint support I do love to lift and definitely want to take care of my joints okay I'm 26 some might say you know it's not that old but I be feeling old sometimes okay I be mm, when I get up and stuff like that's not that ain't cute the most important thing that sold me in burdock root every single day um, d does generically strength the size of breast cancer tumors if you guys don't know my mother is a breast cancer survivor and i thank god every single day that he allows me to still have her with me um and i since it's so close to me because that's my mom i just have to take preventative care and um extra measures to make sure that my health is top tier so definitely when I saw that one of the benefits was to help like you know shrink or just kind of prevent cancer breast cancer tumors from forming sold me and then the last thing that burdock is good for girls so many things but it does actually um, help with your acne now when I um, got this I, I bought all of these mainly from Amazon I'll be leaving everything linked down below so you guys can go and shop that way um, but I've seen so many reviews on Amazon about how it helped people with acne if you guys don't know I do suffer from acne um, my skin has came a very very long way and I'll be making a video about it as soon as my skin gets to you know what I'm saying where I need it to be I'm gonna go ahead and do a video and tell you guys what I did and stuff to clear up my acne I've seen a lot of reviews that said that their severe acne had lessened over time while on this now I I have a healthy diet and I see an esthetician regularly so my acne is not as bad as it was so I can't attest to say that it like cleared my acne or I saw a major difference but I have noticed that even around my monthly I'll get like a lot of hormonal acne around my chin area while on burdock I might get one two on a bad day I'm not saying that it's like the holy grail to get rid of your acne but I'm just saying that since taking it I haven't received normal hormonal acne that I normally would so and the next supplement I want to mention is ashtagawanda this right here is my good sis okay ashtagawanda is known for stress relieving so it just reduces stress and I feel like since we've just been in a ponderosa for uh, almost a year now I feel like everyone's stress has just been <laughs> elevated okay hey look at us look at us huh who would have thought not me um, I started to notice within like two weeks I just felt like more relaxed you do take three of these a day which can be a little bit overwhelming if you're not like a peel peel taker especially with all the other supplements that you would take um, but I love it I don't find anything wrong with it I don't mind taking peels so it's not like a big hassle not only does this also um, help with stress reduction it helps with you gaining muscle mass and strength um, so if you're working out this will be a, a great additive um, it helps with um, if you have anything dealing with cholesterol so if you have high cholesterol or if high cholesterol runs in your family and you just want to do preventative help this is also a great to add into your supplement and then the next thing I want to talk about is mushroom tonic um, basically it helps support your immune system lower blood pressure uh, balance blood sugar and digestion um, it's good for cold and flu it promotes bad cell resistance it's just so much and uh, 
in, in here. <laughs> um, I actually got this from a vendor shop, you know, where people just independently vendors, they sell their things. And he was just so nice. And he told me that his family has been taking this for a very, very long time and they have not got sick and their blood pressure is down. They don't have any crazy things going on. Um, and I was just like, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and give it a try. I believe it was $20. Um, you do drop it. So it's not like a pill form. It's in a dropper. Um, girl, this tastes like a little bit like soy sauce. I ain't gonna hold you. He said you can mix it with your tea, your coffee, whatever you want to do. But I'm the type of person that I just like to just take the supplement and go. So, girl, I take a shot. <laughs> but um, I just basically fill this up with water, tea, um, orange juice, and you post the use 40 to 50 drops three times a day um so i'll just fill this up and you know drop it in there get my little i normally do about 45 sometimes um and then i'll just go ahead and check it back i just feel better after taking it i don't know it's just i don't know if it's just because of the shot i don't know but i just be feeling better okay and then the next supplement i'm going to be talking about is saint john's wart basically this is like a happy pill okay so the main purpose of this pill is to promote a positive and happy type of mood um now this and um and ashtagawanda kind of go hand in hand um they're kind of like cousins so basically they're um supporting um if you're having any anxiety or depression of course um if you have been clinically diagnosed with anxiety or depression um just speak with your medical professional before adding any of these in um but just to take them for a preventative help sometimes you just get in that funk and it's kind of hard to get yourself out of that funk sometimes so um just having something working internally and also doing your self-care your affirmations praying and stuff like that externally you just want something internally to be kind of helping and kind of push you to you know get out of that funk because i know sometimes it's really really hard to get out of and then the next supplement i'm going to be showing you guys is this vitamin c this is the multi system immune defense maximum strength okay we're gonna play about that around here this is going to support a healthy respiratory system um it's going to help with your immune system it's going to give you um high levels of antioxidants um this is just overall great and also this one has um elderberry in it as well i've been taking this every single day um this is like my second bottle um i really really like it i just want to continue to give my body a lot of vitamin c a lot of elderberry just to keep my immune system you know going and getting stronger and stronger and then the next supplement we're going to be talking about it's fortify this is basically a probiotic plus prebiotic if you guys have not heard about probiotics and prebiotics basically what it is is for your overall digestive and your vaginal health um i actually talked about this in a video that i made a while ago i need to make an updated one um i just showed you guys what i take and what i use for my vaginal health to keep her you know what i'm saying keep her right if you don't take prebiotics and probiotics please please add them to your regimen this is really good for digestive so if you are not using the bathroom regularly which you should sis make sure that you add this in it is a little bit pricey i think it's like almost thirty dollars um but it's so worth it and then the next supplement we're going to talk about is evening primrose oil oh i love her i love her too um, so if you ever notice when you're about to come on your menstrual cycle or if you get off your menstrual cycle you're not like sad or anything you're just in this weird phase where like you're kind of irritable a little bit but you want to be loved like it's a lot of things that go on with the woman's body let me just add this y'all men y'all need to put some respect on our species because we be going through a lot okay we go through ovulation times our periods can last damn near almost two but it does help um over over time it doesn't you don't feel as fatigued also this improves your memory y'all my memory is not the best i be forgetting everything so i have to add this into my um my regimen i listen i don't know if that really works because i i still be having trouble with being like who what is that wait what was i supposed to do today that's it's me the next thing that it does is that it increases your libido okay Hmm. Go to the park, get big, man, truck, right in this little garage. <laughs> this actually really does increase your libido. I noticed an increase within like the first couple of days of taking this. Now, it doesn't make you feel like you're off the pink pill or nothing like that, okay? But if I could just say one word that it does make you feel, 
I would say juicy. <laughs> But also, while it does make you feel juicy, okay, sis, we're going to calm it down real quick because maca is also known for increasing your fertility rate. I'm sorry to be a Debbie Daughter to those, but if you are looking into conceiving and you're having any issues, my heart goes out to you. I've seen so many good reviews off Amazon that while taking maca, they were able to conceive. So if you are in that um, ballpark right now, definitely try to give maca a try. Now me, is definitely not in my cards right now. I'm waiting on God to just say when, but right, not right now, not right now. But let's make sure if you are on maca, and you're not trying to conceive to just make sure you're taking the preventative measures. I mean, we should be taking preventative measures anyway. So I'm just gonna put y'all alone though. But this this one's a good one. Overall, just a great supplement to have. And then the last thing I want to show you guys is the um, Amazing Greens Green Superfood. This is a like kind of, I guess it's like a supplement powder. I mean, I take it every day and it has amazing benefits. Um, so basically this has every single Superfood that I really can think of. Wheatgrass, sporella, spinach, beetroot, carrots, um, acai berry. It has maca root in it as well. I drink a green smoothie a day. Now, I know me personally, I find it hard to always have vegetables with every meal, especially sometimes when I'm eating out or I'm on the go. It's kind of hard to eat healthy. And sometimes you look at your food and you'll be like, I don't have any color in my food. Like, that's... That's a problem. So this is definitely a easy, very convenient way to add all of the greens that your body needs in just one scoop. All right, y'all, that's the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you try any of these supplements that I've shown today, please let me know how you like them down below. And it also, if you have any supplements that I did not show today that you think I should add into my regimen, go ahead and leave those down below too because, you know, I'm going to do my research and see what they're talking about, okay? Maybe it's some stuff I'm missing out on, okay? Let me know. But yeah, guys, I'm going to stop rambling. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below what you'll like to see from me next. And of course, do not forget to subscribe to the family. And I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye, y'all.